हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू पांडे गुरुजी यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस द इम्पॉर्टेंट सीक्वल प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चन विच इज बेस्ड ऑन द ज्वाइंस एंड ज्वाइन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द इंटरव्यू पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू सो आई कैन आई टेक इन द डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ द क्वेश्चन विच इज द विच इज आस्किंग इन द इंटरव्यू एंड ऑल्सो इन द रियल टाइम ऑल्सो इफ यू वर्किंग इन द रियल टाइम Uh, what difficulty you face and how you can uh, uh, solve the uh, question so basically uh, when we come to the join the concept uh, all the uh, developer or the student have the concept of the join but uh, they, uh, uh, he or she face the challenging while uh, joining uh, multiple table like uh, which column we need to be consider and uh, which is the common column Uh, so example suppose uh, if, if you have the dim customer table and dim geography table and uh, if you working on the real time then uh, how we can figure out that uh, from this two table uh, which uh, column need to be used for the joining point of view or joining purpose and uh, uh, based on what condition we need can search the uh, matching column or the common uh, column from the two table so we'll discuss uh, also we have the real time database and uh, we also discuss uh, different type of this uh, scenario based uh, uh, question al uh, also so if you are uh, uh, new to my channel you can please uh, subscribe and uh, hit the bell button if you want to uh, practice more question you can visit my website studyatteducation.com uh, if you want to learn the free of cost uh, Uh, all this material we have in download free training material if you want to join one to one classes with me uh, you can uh, directly contact me the number is given on the uh, video description and you can also download my app as well so uh, let's start with the question uh, uh, the what is the first question so uh, let's read the question first so first question is uh, and uh, develop a query to join dim customer and dim geography table okay so basically we have uh, two table dim geography and dim customer table and how we can join with this uh, two table okay so dim customer we have second table we have dim uh, geography we have okay so how we can join this two table this have 655 record and this we have uh, around uh, uh, 18000 record so this two table how we can join and uh, the second question we have find the matching record between employee detail and employee salary based on the employee id so we have uh, i have this uh, table created so let me execute you can download this table structure uh, from the video description and you can open the in SS ssms and you can just copy paste and you can uh, Uh, install the table structure and you can do the practices so first you can uh, pause this video and you can try to solve all the question one by one i will also put this question on the uh, video comment box you can uh, copy that question as well and you can uh, do the practice as well uh, now third question we have based on the uh, condition uh, joining condition uh, fourth question we have uh, based on the multiple table join how we can join with more than one table uh, like employee detail employee salary and department table the fifth question we have that we can how we can find the uh, employee detail which department id is not available in department table so basically we have two table department uh, table and employee detail table so you can see department table we have only four uh, department but salary table we have Uh, some department we ha employ have uh, other than four also like six, uh, null, five, uh, seven. So this data need to be fetched. So uh, first you can uh, try to solve by self, and then you can watch this video continuous. So uh, let's start with this uh, first question. The first question is saying that uh, develop a query to join dim customer with dim geography table. Okay, so. if you have if you working in the real time uh, so uh, let's see uh, if you don't know how, know anything about the table so how we can figure out so you can try to solve this question by using the 
table structure. So table structure you can uh, find by using the sp underscore help. You can direct, direct directly press alt F1 and you can see any foreign key primary key relation uh, what relation we have dim customer to dim geography. So you can see here we have constraint type and uh, here this is the uh, foreign key and primary key uh, relation primary key relation we have in this table dim geography okay so dim geography table uh, dim geography table we have geography key so if you can expand here we have geography key geography key and uh, uh, you can so uh, also find in below you can also find in the below like uh, uh, here also we have some uh, relation like what this is table reference by foreign key so based on this uh, we can just figure out uh, uh, what we have the relation so now we we already figure out dim geography key uh, and uh, geography key is the basically the joining for these two table so we can simply use the dim geography here okay dim customer uh, you can give the some alias name and uh, inner join uh, dim geography like dg uh, one uh, uh, dc dot geography key is equal to uh, dg dot so this is the base on this you can apply this concept in any table this this is the reason i consider this table as example for this uh, uh, question so if you have any table you can just uh, follow the same concept and you can use the you can join this one okay now we have uh, next question we have find the matching record between employee detail and employee salary based on the employee id so here the mention you need to use the employee id uh, column for the matching Imply detail you can uh, give the imply detail as a ed uh, in place of the inner join you can simply write the join also and uh, imply salary uh, es okay uh, on ed dot imply uh, id equal to es dot emp id okay so now this table both table got join okay now third question we have the same the join but we need to be filter greater than 4000 salary okay so same you can copy paste here you need to be write the condition so when we use the join you can write any condition by using the where clause so where imply salary es dot salary is equal to salary is greater than is 4000 okay greater than 4000 so now you will get the imply detail which salary have greater than 4000 only okay so this question we have simple now we have write a query to join the employee detail salary and department table so simply when we working in the join uh, you can join the table with multiple table by simply uh, writing the join okay so here we have the another table come in the picture that is the employees depart because this table this table already we have the join now third table is coming the department table so d on d dot department id equal to because this both the table we have the join so you can consider any table okay so you no no need to consider both the table but if you have the left join then you need to be considered here okay so now you will get the record which is the matchings because in the department table you can see uh, in the department table we have only four department one two three four so uh, other than whatever department available in this table that will not come in the output now the fifth question we have that uh, how we can find the employee detail which department id is not available in department table so this is a little bit tricky tricky question uh, using the join okay so basically they mention you 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 no need to use the join so simply if if they not put this uh, uh, cloud using the join so what will be happen uh, they mention the employee detail which department id is not available in department table okay so if they not use that you join you can pu put simply uh, select r from uh, 
uh, by using the sub query select of an implied detail uh, where department id not in you can put the select select star from department okay so basically department table so department id okay so you will get all the data which is not available in department table so this is the first way you can write okay but the question they asking you need to be use the join so no need to use this concept okay do not use this because interviewer they simplify that you have any idea how you can achieve the by using the join so how we can achieve by using the join okay so basically join condition you need to be use the left join okay so left join basically what will be happen left outer join or left join uh, when you use the left outer join or left join the concept is saying that uh, uh, the data from the left table as well as the matching record as well as the data from the left table so whatever the corresponding data from the right table it should be come as a null so you can execute this one which is the not matching record so this is the matching record okay so in the right table this two column is from the right table okay but which is not matching you can see this is coming as a null value corresponding to the right table so simply you can use the left join and you can put the where d dot department id is null okay so when you put this condition or output got achieved okay so now you can see here this is the data implied d so you can just remove uh, this two column so you can see uh, in the first output how many record is coming three five seven and ten implied d second is also if you execute you can see uh, is coming or oh, five six seven null is also coming so the reason if you using the join null value is also because the data is inserted null for this employee key okay so this is also implied department id not available in department sometimes they will put you we don't want to show the null value okay so what will be happen happen you you can put also and uh, and you can put the ed dot department is not null so if you have the concept if any interview cross question you get you can so if a interviewer asks you i don't want this null value so you can put this additional filter okay so by using this uh, all this concept you can um, you can solve this all type of the uh, uh, question if you have any type of the question so i hope you understand how we can solve the question based on the join and definitely you will get the question uh, in the interview uh, based on uh, this type of the question only okay uh, still if you have any doubt if you have any question you can directly put in the comment box and if you not subscribe please subscribe the channel thank you